Hey guys, I'm back with a very quick video just discussing two supplements that I'll be using for the next few months. So I decided to go ahead and start trying to take multivitamins daily. So I picked up the Nature Made Vitamins. It's 90 tablets in here and it's the multivitamins for her with iron and calcium. So it has more extra iron and calcium because I do need the extra calcium. Um, it also says 23 key nutrients for daily nutritional support. So I picked up these at my local grocery store. Um, they had a sale promotion going on this week. It was, I'm actually going to pick up some more um, at the end of the week too. So I'll have some for the next few months. Well, the next month after. So they were having a sale. Buy one, get one free. So I bought these. Um, and I plan on taking these every morning. And I also bought... Biotin. So I bought one and I got the Biotin for free. So I decided to take Biotin. On here it says it's 2500 MCGs. So here's the little bottle, and this is also Nature's Made as well. And these are 90 liquid soft gel. So let me show you what the multi vitamins look like. So this is the size of the multivitamin. Um, about the size is like how the um, Centrums look. About that size. Uh, if you're not good with swallowing pills, it's probably good, too big for you. And the size of the Biotin is very little. I'm trying not to drop it. And they're these foods. These say you should both take both of them with the meals. Actually, where did you see that? It actually doesn't say, but I'm pretty sure you're supposed to take these for best. Yes, it says um, for best results, take one tablet daily with the meal. So I took these this morning right before I ate my, um, well, this afternoon right before I ate my lunch because I just brought them this morning. And I'm going to take my Biotin tablets with dinner or my last pill of the day because I've read that you shouldn't combine these um, well, multivitamins with Biotin or MS. Um, MSN, whatever it's called. Yeah, I heard you shouldn't combine these. Um, so I'm gonna take these at night. Now the biotin I'm using primarily to grow up my nails and to help grow up my hair. And it says for healthy hair, skin, and nails. They did have some with that were 3,000 MCGs, but um, they said for maximum amount of biotin, if you were diagnosed by a doctor to have biotin deficiency I decided not to get that because a is my first time and I've always I've heard mixed reviews with biotin that it definitely caused different breakouts and some people have issues with it um, with any supplement because you're not used to taking it your body may react to it just like if you stop eating a whole bunch of junk food your body may react to it for a while you might break out and go through different changes because your body is getting used to um, changes within your body so I've been doing my research on biotin and MSN for a while. Um, what prompted me to really start taking it was um, an update from my natural sisters. Um, I put the video I watched um, a couple days ago down below, um, and she started. One of the sisters started taking biotin and MSN within the past six months, and she had a huge, um, huge growth in her hair. So I decided that I would go ahead and try it. I didn't want to take both. Um, I just want to try one because I'm already restarting to take the multivitamins. You can have it taken vitamins in a couple years now. So I said I'll just start with the biotin and see how this works for me. So yeah, I'm going to give it a try and I'll let you guys know how that works. Um, also, um, I will be changing my diet. So it's... Um, not going to go cold turkey or nothing. I'm going to wean off juices and sodas and all that other stuff um, within the next few weeks. I don't want to just go like that, even though that's probably the best way to usually that's how I do it anyway. But um, within this next, by the end of this month, I want to be drinking um, only water. And other than my smoothies, that's all I want to be drinking is water. Um, I brought plenty of fruits and throughout the school year, I'm going to not try my best not to eat any lunch meat sandwiches at all um only eat fruits 
vegetables throughout the day and at night I will have a full meal that's the plan so throughout the day morning I'll have my fruit smoothies lunch I'll have either a smoothie or fruits and vegetables and at night I'll have a full meal consisting of protein a starch a vegetable so that's my plan now currently I am do I even want to tell you this let me think about it <laughs> yeah so currently I'm I fluctuate between 2.30 and 2.50. Um, within the past four years, I was taking the Depo-Provera shot, which caused me to gain a significant amount of weight between 30 and 50 pounds. So um, my doctor has been telling me for a while that I need to cut out all these fast food and stuff. Well, I'm going to take them seriously because I am about to graduate college. I want to have my mind set straight and I want to start eating healthy because I want to live them. So yeah, so this is just not about a hair and um, hair journey thing, about me just growing long hair. I want to be healthy overall. So that's why I'm not titling this video just health or a healthy hair journey. It's just a health update for the month of August. And once I do do my big chop, I will start doing separate videos for health and separate videos for hair journey. But I decided to wait until I do my big chop because it's no point because I'm cutting off all my text box hair eventually anyway so once I do that that's when I'll start my healthy hair journey videos so yeah I'm gonna try my best to update you guys it probably won't be every month but periodically when I feel that I am making some strides within my health I will update you guys on what's going on but like I said um, the month of August today is August 5th I am now starting these these will last me about it's 90 tablets in each this will last me about two and a half three more a little less than three months because it's 31 days in this month and it's like 30 days in September. You get the point. Like I said, I'm going to buy some more this week. I'm going to probably, because these expire May 16th. Oh, that's a while. But since they're buy one, get one free, I'm just going to go ahead and buy a couple more bottles of each. So they'll last me for another couple months. For another six to nine months. So, um, I will update you after these are done if I feel like I've had a extreme amount of growth using the biotin and what my reactions were using both of these. So thank you both. Thank you all for watching. So yeah, thank you for watching. Um, like I said, I'll update you on how everything goes and I'll see you in my next video.